Yo, what's good kings and queens? It's your boy Don and I'm back for another reaction video today. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell and hit all so you know every time I post you heard. If you're not new to the channel, y'all already know what to do. Go down below, hit that like button. Y'all already know if you get pinned, you win, you heard. Yo, as y'all can see by the thumbnail and title, we're going to be reacting to the five most unusual houses in the world. Don't mind me, son. It's mad stuff going on outside. I'm panicking. But anyway, y'all, if y'all have been in an unusual home, my first thought of an unusual home, I'm not going to lie. When I was a kid in New York, we lived above the corner store. It was mad weird. It was unusual to me because I never saw nothing like that. So that's probably the most unusual my house has gotten. Let me know down in the comments if y'all have lived in some unusual homes. My plan is to start doing some Airbnbs and all that, vibe out, get to go to some unusual type homes and all that, and y'all get to see, you know, experience the vibe through my eyes, you heard? Other than that, let's get into the video, let's see what they talking about, let's see which homes is unusual. Hi everyone. Now in recent years, architecture has moved far ahead. It definitely has. as a result of this, people are building more and more unusual houses and hotels to stick out from the crowd as much as possible. True. So with that said, here are our picks for five of the most unusual houses and hotels located all around the world. Let's get it on. Now, if you like these kind of videos and want to see more, then make sure to leave us a like on the video, subscribe to our channel, and turn on post notifications to be the first to watch all our new and exciting videos. Every first comment will be getting pinned, so good luck. God. Come on, get into it. Let's get tuned. Number five, Skysphere. Imagine a home in the clouds with beautiful 360 degree views and the capability of controlling everything with a smartphone. Well, that, my friends, is known as the Skysphere, which is situated amongst the hills of the Palmerston North in New Zealand. It was created by Jonah Williams, whose passion for design and engineering led him to construction of this unusual structure. Besides its technological features, it was also created to withstand earthquakes as I've well as extremely before. strong winds. <clears throat> And all this can be accessed via a ladder in the central cylinder, which takes you up to a room filled yep. with everything you could possibly need. It's a vibe. Oh my goodness. Far out. This what a is kitchen absolutely at. spectacular. What a bathroom. Number four, Igloo. While it may sound weird that this resort contains oh, blue looking structures with a massive skylight, oh, I saw this. the reason why will surely make you want to go there. <clears throat> I do. These little luxury suites yeah. located in offer guests the perfect way to take a glimpse of the stunning Aurora Borealis in a cozy observational room. Guests can enjoy their stay in these unusual igloos with all the surrounded comforts of these beautifully designed glass igloos. With each igloo containing a double bed, a bathroom, and a personal sauna, along with all the other amenities you could possibly think of in a hotel room. Nice. Number three, underwater room. This three-floor piece of luxury is situated 820 feet from the little known island this? of Pemba, just off the mainland of Tanzania. The top floor consists of a balcony with beautiful 360-degree unobstructed views, which are perfect for stargazing at night and soaking in the sun during the day. It must not storm. The middle floor consists of a dining room and kitchen, which offer guests the chance to relax and enjoy the exceptional views. And finally, the third floor lies 13 feet under the sea. This beautiful yet unusual nah, addition lit. allows guests to observe the marine life during the day and sleep peacefully at night. <clears throat> That's dead wavy. <clears throat> Number two, Boeing 727 home. 
an Oregon man known as Bruce Campbell turned a Boeing 747 airplane into his own home, which he lives in for around six months every year. Nice. The aircraft features a makeshift shower, along with a living and dining area, a kitchen, bathroom, and even a place to sleep. Nice. This plane definitely has it all. However, as of this very day, he's continually trying to restore some of the plane's original interior elements. Well, he's trying to get it going. And lights. All this set him back a whopping $220,000 to set it all up initially. <clears throat> it's crazy, y'all. Uh... People have asked me Smart, though. it crashed here, and I simply restored the wreck. That's an odd thing to hear. It's, it's completely impractical. Mm -hmm. Number one. Sky Lodge. Only adrenaline junkies would need to apply for the Natura Vive Sky Lodge Adventure Suites, which cling to the side of one of Peru's highest peaks located eight miles or so from Machu Picchu in the heart of the Secret Valley. No, on, I'm These sure. glass pods are actually rooms that offer an astounding view. But I gotta valley. try it, son. <laughs> Each pod is said to be 25 like feet I long to. and 8 feet high and made of aluminum and polycarbonate that offer 300 degree views. Beautiful, All son. this has a catch, however. As you gotta to climb to get pod, there. You have to climb your way up a 400 foot cliff, which is something not everyone is willing Yo, to I'm do. Yo, I'm doing it, son. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Oh, no, I'm dead doing it. If they, if they gonna make it that easy, <laughs> I'm doing Anyway, that has been it for today's video. Oh, Which man. What's your favorite hook? <clears throat> Dang. Hold on. I want to see all the of list. them again. Let okay. us know why down in the comments. Thanks for watching, and we hope to see you next time. I thought they was going to show them all again. I guess not. Yo, if y'all enjoyed this video, let me know down in the comments what was your favorite home. I like the igloo ones. Them John, son, they've been fired to me for a minute. So I'm trying to get there. You are. However I need to get there, y'all let me know. If, um... <clears throat> Damn, my throat. Yo, if y'all enjoyed this video, let me know down in the comments. Like I mentioned, which one was your favorite part? Let me know if I should react to something similar or different than this. I got y'all, you heard? Moral of the story is, y'all gotta go out there and experience everything in order to know something. I just posted the last video. About to go post another one right now. I'm gonna see y'all there, you heard? Peace. Love. Done.